Ghost of Tsushima vs Rise of Ronin Who can win in an actual fight? Who is actually the best warrior? Today let's take a deep dive and see who is actually stronger Ghost of Tsushima is a straightforward downright samurai who is trained by professional force and who is meant to fight in an actual battlefield so his swordsman skill is definitely amazing and Rise of Ronin, just as his name, is Ronin and he's being trained by the Veiled Edge as an assassin and Veiled Edge is known to train one of the best assassins which means their combat skill when fighting enemy one by one should be unmatched so who's actually stronger? that's actually not a straightforward question it depends on what scenario they are fighting and what job are they performing first let's start with a fair duel if you only talk about with no weapon, no arrow, no using guns for sure simply using sword and fight head to head dead on we can look at Ghost of Shima the way he fights is very flowy, relaxed and there is no unnecessary movement the goal is the flow of the opponent and his movement is small and precise especially when he does parry He's not actually using his brutal force to break enemies attack He simply just hold the sword steady, turn around his body and then let the sword pass and he can attack from the back This will save a lot of his energy and make sure he can last longer in the fight and easily break his enemy's balance and on the other hand, in the Rise of Ronin you can see his movement is fast and actually bigger it does have a lot of power in it and when he does parry you can see it just simply uses brutal force to break enemy's attack this seems strong and powerful but if it's in an actual combat he won't last long so as the fight drag on longer he will slowly get weaker and weaker so if goes to Tsushima and Rise of Ronin fighting a heavy combat most likely the result is beginning to break even because both of them are still samurais and as the fight drag longer Rise of Ronin will slowly lose his strength faster than Ghost of Tsushima and that's when he will lose second let's talk about fighting a real life situation which will involve using all kinds of weapons basically guns, kunai, the hook, throwing stuff, anything you want in this way Rise of might have the upper hand because as assassin ninja he has a more nasty move compared to Ghost of Tsushima which is being taught as a righteous samurai who use sword and arrow so let's say they know they are fighting each other when they first encounter they will be a far away distance Rise of Ronin can simply pull his gun and shoot Ghost of Tsushima and because guns normally has longer range than arrows Ghost of Tsushima will not be able to attack back but if Rise of Ronin lose the first shot and because the gun takes forever to reload the good chance is Ghost of Tsushima will charge forward towards him and start pulling out arrows to shoot him and at this moment Rise of Ronin can simply just use his hook and throw the barrel towards Ghost of Tsushima and the fight will be finished but if it's in the most unlikely scenario that Ghost of Tsushima escape that move, predict that move and then he gets to a closer mid range and he can throw kunai and break Rise of off his balance and pull his sword and take him down so this fight is all about if Ghost of Tsushima survive the first half of the fight and if he can, he will have the upper hand of the second half and overall this fight will be very fast because every single attack they pull is very deadly and actually every single move is faster than just simply using sword because if the sword gives you something is not right most likely the closer you're gonna pull back and observe the opposite side so you will take a lot more observation but in this case because it involves long range weapons so they won't have any time to lay back and observe each other so to say who is stronger we can actually simply look at it this way in a real life combat if it's indoor Ghost of Tsushima will win because the room won't be that big and Ghost of Tsushima has upper hand in the medium to short range fight if he's outside, which the space will be huge Rise of Ronin has the upper hand because it's stronger in medium to longer range attack 